Hi, I am uh, Manish Pandit and today I am going to be explaining to you how to do a short or really a sh super short Mahaganapati Homam. Now for this Homam procedure what you are going to require is a copper Homakundam. The Homakundam must not be made of any other material other than copper. Traditionally Homakundams have always been made of copper. If you can't use a copper homokundam and you have the ability to actually go inside your garden like this, you can actually dig a fire pit and I'll show you an example of that in a little while. So what you're going to require apart from that is some wood kindling if you're doing it outside. If, if you're not doing it outside the house, then what you're going to require is uh, this um, uh, dried coconut and you can get some decent dried coconut from of this brand over here. Alternatively, if you're doing it outside the house, then you can use some nice wood kindling. Now this is what I've used over here. I've got some wood kindling in front of me in this. It's made up in a form of a very straightforward uh, inverted triangle, which is a Kali Yantra. You can make it in the form of an upright triangle, which would be a Shiva Yantra, or you can use any, any manner of whatever you want to do. I've got a little bit of camphor within this and you can see that this camphor is what is going to make this thing burn. So the first thing I do is I say Riddhayas Mahavair Namasopasadhya Mitram Devam Mitram Dheyam No Astu Anuradhana Habisha Vardhayanta Shatam Jeevema Sharadasavira And I remember my uh, mother, uh, so Shri Saraswati Panditaya Namaha, I remember my, both my parents. Om Shri Madhavitra Bhyom Namaha Then I remember my Guru uh, So Om Shri Nakhate Maharajaya Namaha Then I remember my Ved Guru Om Shri Fatak Maharaj Ki Jai Then I remember uh, Vashishta Rishi who is my Gotra Rishi And you should try and remember your Gotra Rishi as well at this point Om Shri Vashishta Rishi Namaha Then remember the seven Rishis Om Saptrishaya Namaha then remember all the other rishis. Om Anya Rishi Bhyo Namo Namaha. Now I've got an, a small idol of Ganesha over here. And what I'm going to be doing is worship this uh, idol of Ganesha first. Om Shri Vigneshwaraya Namaha. Asanam Samarvayami. Padyam Samarvayami. Argyam Samarvayami. Achamaniam Samarvayami. Snanam Samarvayami. Snananandar Achamaniam Samarvayami. Namaskaromi. Shri Vigneshwaraya Namaha Akshatan Samarvayami Akshatarupam Vastram Samarvayami Akshatarupam Puitam Samarvayami Akshatan Samarvayami Gandhan Dharayami Om Shri Vigneshwaraya Namaha Namaskaromi Om Shri Vigneshwaraya Namaha Om Shri Vigneshwaraya Namaha Dhupam Samarpayami Om Shri Vigneshwaraya Namaha Om Shri Vigneshwaraya Namaha Aratikam Samarpayami Om Shri Vigneshwaraya Namaha Aradigam Samar Vayami Namaskaromi So the next step is the Sankalpa and in the Sankalpa what we are trying to do is we are taking one of the great elements in our hand which is water so I take this element in my hand and then pour this water onto the ground which is another one of the great elements or earth thereby sealing this sort of oath Om Shri Parameshwara Prithyartham Shri Mahaganapati Prasada Siddhartham 
अद्य शुभ दिने शुभ मुहूर्ते श्री महागणपति होम कर्म यथाशक्ति करिष्ये सो दिस वॉज द संकल्प नाव द नेक्स्ट स्टेप इज रियली टू स्टार्ट द महागणपति होम द फर्स्ट फाइव आहुति सो द फर्स्ट फाइव ऑब्लेशन इन टू द फायर विल बी डन यूजिंग द फाइव मंत्रास इन ऑर्डर ओम प्रजापताये नम स्वाहा ओम इंद्राय नम स्वाहा ओम अग्नय नम स्वाह ओम सोमाय नम स्वाह एंड देन ओम भूर्भव स्व स्वाहा दीज आर द फाइव मंत्रास विच आर यूज फॉर दिस रिचुअल इन द फर्स्ट प्लेस ओम भूर्भव स्वरोम अग्नि प्रतिष्ठापयामी then i place a piece of dried coconut on top of this to make it a bit easier for it to catch fire now what i've done over here is om bhur bhav swaro magnim pratisthapayami with this mantra i have enkindled the fire now the next thing i'm going to do is say the agni dhyana mantra this is a vedic mantra you may not know it properly but what you want to do is at least play a audio of this or just think of the fire in your mind while you're doing this if you i i would i would stress you must be able to say this mantra properly i you must intone it properly with the proper swaras if you can't do that just think of it in your mind om chatvari shringa trayo asya pada dvai shirshe sapta hastaha so asya tridhavaddho vresha bhoro or viti maho devo marthi hama vivesha एष ही देव प्रदीशो नु सर्वा पूरो ही जात स ओ गर्भे अंत सभी जायम स जनिष्यम प्रत्यंग मुखा तिष्टति विश्व मुखा प्रांग मुखो देव हे अग्ने अभिमुखो भवाम नेक्स्ट स्टेप इज टू पुट सम अक्षता और रॉ राइस इन द एट कॉर्नर्स ऑफ द होम कुंड एंड देन इन द सेंटर सो स्टार्टिंग विद इंद्रा विच इज द ईस्ट सो आई एम फेसिंग ईस्ट एज यू नो वो हेयर सो दिस इज ओम इंद्राय नम हम अग्नय नम ओम ओम यमाय नम ओम निरुक्त नम हम वरुणा नम हम वायवे नम हम सोमाय नम हम कुबेरा नम ईशानाय नम मध्यज्ञ नम यज्ञपुरषा नमो नम सर्वेभ्यो ब्राह्मणेभ्यो नमो नम हि इज रिक् एन स्रिक् so the rick is the one i usually use for pouring oblations the srik is only used for purnahuti now i draw two parallel lines over here to represent the female force or shakti so this is between me and the homa kundam the five oblations which i am going to pour in the fire are going to be to prajapati then to indra then to agni then to soma and then to prajapati again so these are om prajapati swaha om prajapati dam namama om indraya swaha om indraya dam namama om agnaya swaha om agnaya dam namama om somaya swaha om somaya dam namama ओम संकल्प प्रभृति दक्षिण पर्यतम समस्त बाबुक्षार्थम सर्वोष प्रायश्चिताथम सर्वप्रायश्चिम होश्या ओम भूर्भ स्वस्व ओम प्रजापतेद नम सो द नेक्स्ट स्टेप विच आई एम गोइंग टू डू इज बेसिकली आई एम गोइंग टू रिक्वेस्ट दिस फायर टू कम इन साइड मी एंड इन किंडल माय ओन अग्नि सो आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू मेल्ट इट फॉर अ फ्यू सेकेंड्स एंड थिंक ऑफ दैट now that really is the subtle meaning of fire worship uh which is which is what i'm trying to convey over here the next thing which i'm going to do is i'm going to call my ishta devata over here uh which is ganesha om bija purgadeshu chakravja pashotpala vriyagra soishana ratna kalasha pradyot karam bho ruha deyo vallabhaya sabatma karaya slishto jala dhusha vishvotpatti vipatti samstiti karo vignesha ishtardha ओम श्री महागणपत नम इगछ इगछ इह तिष्ठ इह इह स्थित इह सन्निस्व इह सन्नीहत अत्रिष्ठा कुर दैवक्तशूल परत्राण पराये दे जो वाट तुम पूजेशा तो वाट तम सुस्थिरा भवा श्री विघ्नेशरा नम नमस्को श्री विघ्नेशरा नम अक्षता समर्पयामी अक्षता वस्त्र समर्पयामी अक्षता उपवीत समर्पयामी अक्षता समर्पयामी 
ओम सुमुखाय नम ओम एकदंताय नम ओम वक्रतुंडाय नम ओम गजकर्णकाय नम ओम लंबोदराय नम ओम धूम्रगेतव नम ओम श्री विघ्नेश्वराय नम ओम श्री महागणपत नम दिन गुण टू ऑफ सम गंधा श्री महागणपत नम गंधारयामी Now the next step in this homam is that I'll start offering uh, mantras to Mahaganapati now. So this will be starting with a simple mantra like Om Shri Ganesha Namah Swaha, Om Shri Ganesha Namah Swaha, Om Shri Ganesha Namah Swaha, Om Vakradunda Mahakaya Surya Kodi Samaprabha Nirvignam Kuru Medeva Sarvakareshu Sarvada Swaha. ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटे समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटे समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटे समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटे समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटे समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा नाउ यू नीड नॉट लिमिट योर सेल्फ टू वेरी बेसिक ऑब्लेशन यू कैन यूज इफ यू लाइक दीज पीसेस ऑफ ब्राइट कोकोनट ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटे समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटे समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा Now you notice that I am only using these three fingers to hold uh, the oblations. That's what I usually do, unless it is for the for holding the rick. Om Vakratunda Mahakaya Surya Kodi Sama Prabha Nirvik Dhamkuru Me Deva Sarva Karishu Sarva Daswa Ha. There is a reason for this, and the reason for this is that uh, this index finger usually represents uh, the e- ego principle. Uh, so what I try to do is use this. This also forms a mudra on its own. ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटि समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटि समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटि समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटि समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटे समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा ओम वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटे समप्रभा निर्विघ्न कुर मे देव सर्वकारेशु सर्वद स्वाहा नाउ आई यूजुअली ऑफ अ वैरायटी ऑफ मंत्रस इन टू द फायर बट बिकॉज दीज आर मंत्रस व्हिच आई हैव प्यूरिफाइड टू सम एक्सटेंड आई टेंड नॉट टू रिपीट देम अलाउड so uh i then go on to do my worship uh, as it is and you you can watch over here now the other technique i use when i'm doing this is as you're saying your mantra you can actually imagine that it's a part of your body or your mind or whatever it is you want to purify so say you think of your eyes first so you say your mantra whatever it is so i'm going to say it in my mind and you think that you're offering it into the fire and you're trying to gain uh, divinity within your vision you're trying to be able to transcend the limitations that your physical eyes have om shri mahaganapadaye dam namama so i'll continue offering these mantras uh, but without saying them aloud 
uh, because those are my purified mantras or Siddha mantras. Now, I'll be offering some black sesame seeds with mantras. Black sesame seeds are very powerful for destroying uh, negative karma, especially that pertaining to the physical body. Om Shri Ganesha Namah Swaha 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 Now, at this stage within the homam, I usually offer two uh, pieces of uh, sopari into the fire. So you can use whatever mantra you want and offer these into the fire. The, the reason I do this is uh, that because they are actually almost like full fruits. So they give you the effect of a purnahuti but within uh, the fire, when, when the fire is actually happening. I'm going to put a couple of these suparis and a dried coconut, a full dry, uh, half dried coconut into the fire. Uh, so a half dried coconut and two suparis into the fire is Purnahuti. Om Purnahuti Uttamam Jahodi Saramam Bhai Purnahuti Asya Mevam Pratitishtha Om Shri Mahaganavadaya Purnahuti Samarabhaya Amin Omana Swaha Now what I'm going to do is uh, pour with the srik uh, some mantras. Uh, you may or may not be able to say these mantras. Om Shanchame Mayaschame Priyanchame Nukamaschame Kamaschame Somanasaschame Padranchame Shreyaschame Vatsaschame Yashaschame Bhagaschame Dravinanchame Yandachame Dharatachame Kshemaschame Dhritishchame Vishwanchame Mahachame Samvichame Dhryatranchame Sushchame Prasushchame Siranchame Layaschame Ratanchame Mratanchame Yakshmanchame Namayachame Jeevadushchame Dhirgha Yuttanchame Anamitranchame Bhayanchame Suganchame Shayananchame Sushachame Sudinanchame Om Shanti 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 Now the rest of the mantras uh, which I say I'm going to say over here so, and then I'll tell you which are the absolute essential mantras for the super short portion. Om Prajavadena Tudedadan Yavishwa Jatani Paritabha Bhuva Yatkama Stadium Stana Sto Vegas Sama Padre Nagum Swaha Prajavadayam Om Bhu Swaha Om Agnayam Om Bhuvaha Swaha Om Vaivayam Om Subaha Swaha Om Surya Adam Noi the Sakaram Northa Tirijam Yidana Mehagram Agnestas Vestagra Dudana Sarum Sistum Sodam Guru Swaha Agnes Vestagreda the Mom, Samstram Jehodis Saha, Vasubir Drevia, the Tevia, Samstra, Hagi the Mom, Burva Saha, Prajava the Edam Nama, Omaid Nadabrai, Chitta, the Nigarisham, Naha, Nadam Yada, Nadam Yetna Segret, Evito, Agne, Tadasa Kalvet, Togum, Heme, the Edhatam Saha, Agnetum, Om Purishasam Mito, Yet no, Yet no Purishasam Mita, Agne, Tadasa Kalvet, Togum, Heme, the Edhatam Saha. Om Agnetum, Om Yetpak, Tramasa, Dina, Chana, Yetna Semarte, Martasa, Agnesh, Tota, Krade, Dejan, and Yajish Tode, and Rudu Shoyari, Swaha, Om Agnetum. The last three mantras were the uh, Agni Prashita mantras uh, for asking for forgiveness from Agni for any, any uh, mistakes done during the fire ritual. But the universal mantra which you can use for this particular purpose uh, is Om. Bhur Bhuva Swaha Swaha So just using the mantras Om Bhu Swaha, Om Bhuva Swaha, Om Suva Swaha and Om Bhur Bhuva Swaha Swaha after your homam, after your Purnahuti are enough.